A seismic shift in the Las Vegas real estate market, May 2021. This video explains what is going on in this extreme seller's Las Vegas real estate market, along with why shouldn't you wait for an avalanche of foreclosures and short sales, eye-popping price hikes so far in 2021 even in the stagnant high-rise market, exploding Las Vegas economy, why will these price gains go on unabated for the remainder of 2021? What is the best course of action for house and condo buyers and sellers? That is why you watch these videos anyway. The title of our last October video was Pessimistic About the Las Vegas Real Estate Market. Our information was based on scary numbers about upcoming evictions and a significant number of homeowners falling behind in their mortgage. Well, an election happened and $2.8 trillion in additional printed money prevented an avalanche of evictions. Only 2% of homeowners are currently underwater, and given the skyrocketing prices, that is shrinking further. So do not hold your breath for a significant number of foreclosures in the future, even though short sales may increase a bit. And as we will explain, their effect on the home prices will be negligible, except for finding a good deal here and there. So let's dig in and see what is going on. The only criterion governing residential real estate pricing, the only factor that controls homes and condos pricing is supply and demand, or the number of active listings divided by unit sales. That is it. At the end of April, only 1,827 home listings were listed in the MLS that were not under contract which is slightly higher than in the last two months, but not enough to make a dent. 3,699 new listings were added in the same period. At the same time, 3,574 houses have sold, which means pretty much every listing that is priced reasonably is trading within a month, except for highly overpriced ones. Please note that March 2021 home sales dwarfed the sales numbers in the previous two years, as does April's. But the April sales numbers in 2020 were affected by the COVID-19 lockdown. Supply and demand is calculated by dividing active listing inventory by the sales numbers, and the result is called months of listing inventory, which stands at 0.5 months. This low number is why the skyrocketing prices will go up until we hit at least four months worth of active listing inventory. To reach a price neutral period, we need 3,547 times 4 equals 14,188 minus 1,827 equals 12,360 more active listings. And we can pretty much guarantee that is not going to happen this year. We highly doubt that we could reach 35% of that number in 2021. So price gains will go on for the remainder of the year. But at what rate? The median price and price per square foot of Las Vegas single-family houses. The median price of Las Vegas homes in April 2021 stands at $375,000, which is $30,000 or 8.7% higher than January. The year-to-year -year median price gain of single-family houses is at a misleading 21%. But we have corrected it to 17.2%. Since the median price of houses stood at $319,000 in March before COVID-19, and it appreciated to $325,000 in July. So $310,000 for a couple of months during the lockdown period is misleading, but the median price only shows the market direction in lower price ranges. The price per square foot of all homes sold is calculated by dividing the square footage of all units sold in a period by their accumulative prices. Price per square foot is a better criterion that shows whether home prices are appreciating or not. And it stands at $208 per square foot in April. Las Vegas home price appreciation rates per month in 2021. This table shows the median and price per square foot of homes sold in several periods. We will show the median price gains and price per square foot appreciation, but we'll discuss the latter. 
The price per square foot of single-family houses appreciated by 11.5% in 2020. The following three columns show the price per square foot gains per month in 2021, and it is going up at an eye-popping 3% per month. We can pretty much guarantee that this appreciation rate will be matched or surpassed every month through August. This means that home buyers will be paying at least 12% more in only four months. For a $375,000 median priced house, buyers will pay $45,000 more than they would pay now. If price appreciations keep the same pace, the home buyer's rush due to skyrocketing prices could lead to 20% to 30% home price appreciation this year. Average days on the market until sold. The average days on the market have fallen to 30 days due to the influx of cash buyers and should go down further as we approach summer. Original asking list price versus the sales price. This graph shows the original asking list, list price, which is often high, versus the sales price, and it is a little higher than 100%. This is why you read in news articles that a full price offer is a weak offer nowadays. What should financing home buyers who are hitting a brick wall do? We did say in the beginning that the only factor controlling home prices in the months of listing inventory. However, it is influenced by the historically low mortgage rates, which amount to free money given the upcoming inflation. Escalating prices lead to a rush of investors who pay with cash as well as owner occupiers. So financing buyers, especially first-time home buyers, hit a brick wall, but there are ways around us. Call us at 702-478-7800 to see how. Financing buyers can compete well with cash buyers through becoming underwritten approved for their mortgage. We explain the process in the Mortgage Guide for Las Vegas Homes, Condos, High-Rise Buyers video. A seismic shift in the Las Vegas housing market. The seismic shift in the Las Vegas real estate market, especially where luxury houses and high-rise condos are concerned, is due to the influx of California buyers or those moving here from areas like Denver or Seattle. Our residential real estate is dirt cheap to them. Someone owning a 1967 two-bedroom house in Los Angeles could pay cash for a luxury house in some of the best locations here. As we explain in Las Vegas high-rise condo updates, its recovery is more like a rocket recovery than a V-shaped recovery. High-rise condo sales and prices were stagnant from 2019 to November 2020, and then they took off in the winter of 2020. Some units are selling for 10 to 15% more than January. However, competition for high-rise condo sale pales compared to traditional houses and condos and there will be limited opportunity to buy these before prices go even higher. As for the economy, which is already exploding, strip casinos have set a record for winning in the past eight years, and local casinos have broken their all-time winning record, and they have done it based on 60% occupancy. Imagine what happens in the summer with masks removed indoors and 100% occupancy. At the same time, Resorts World and MSG Sphere are going to come online as well. The deal is that the U.S. economy has added more than $5 billion in printed money, and we bet our bottom dollar that our fair city will get its cut, especially with the pent-up demand. Do not wait for prices to come down anytime soon, and when they do, it will be from much higher levels than now. One of the most stupid news stories that we have seen this year concerned an older gentleman who had sold his house and was renting while waiting for the sanity to return to his real estate market. If Florida is anything like our city, he will pay 30% or more for the sanity. We do not believe that barring another catastrophe, you will see the current price again. Las Vegas condos and townhomes market. We will not waste much time here as the condos and townhomes market mirrors the single family home market. Again, our months of listing inventory are at 0.5 months, and unit sales at 1,024 units have surpassed March of 2019 and 2020, which is before COVID-19 hit, by 56% and 40% respectively. At the same time, the number of active listings for April is 592. 
The median price of Las Vegas homes and condos for April 2021 is $202,450, and the price per square foot of units is at $180 per square foot. Again, the monthly price per square foot appreciation of units for January 2021 through April is 3.6% from January to February, 0.6% for March, and 2.6% for April. The appreciation rates will escalate for the summer months. It should be noted that the condo and townhomes market heated up a bit later than single-family houses because many buyers are getting priced out of single-family houses. And if they continue appreciating <clears throat> at the same rate, condos and townhomes will appreciate about 20% this year. What should buyers and sellers do in the current Las Vegas real estate market? In normal years, and this year is anything but, Homes and condos start appreciating in February, gather pace in April, and appreciate the most in June through August. Price hikes level off in September through Thanksgiving and go down a bit from Thanksgiving to Christmas. We have shown that the price of a median-priced home could appreciate by $45,000 by August. So if you have to sell, wait and list your home in August and hopefully call us at 702-478-7800 to help get the maximum money out of it. If you are a buyer, again, call us, but if you don't, do all you can to buy as soon as possible. Summer months will be much harder to get an offer accepted, but if you follow our mortgage financing advice and hire realtors like us who have been successfully navigating the same kind of housing market a couple of times, there is no reason that you shouldn't succeed after a few tries. The spoils go to the prepared and persistent, and in this case, early birds get the worm. We were usually the first to make an offer on our deals, and if you are waiting even one day to make an appointment to see a house, you lose. Lastly, the rich get richer and the poor don't. Rental rates for entry-level condos are up by more than 20% since 2019 and moving higher. The same goes for smaller houses, and sooner or later we will run into affordability issues, but we are obviously not there yet. If you find the information in the seismic shift in the Las Vegas real estate market in May 2021 helpful, please like the video and subscribe to our real estate channel. This is Karen Sabrazade of Realty One Group and Las Vegas Homes, Condo, and Luxury High-Rise Condos, wishing you a great day.